Hello people, this is Power here with the review with the Ultraman Rube DX Rube Crystal Set 5. Now this set consists of Ultraman Belial, Ginga Victory, Saga, and Grugio King. And um, as you can see from the front of the box, Bel Belial, <laughs> Belial is used on the latter half to summon the Kiwami Crystal along with Ultraman, which we will take a look at later. And... Obviously, Grugio Bone is the evolution of Grugio King is the evolution of Grugio Bone, and these two are just here because of fusions, which makes sense. Ultraman Rube Rube Crystal Set Five. Um, what it does on the back, and that will be it. So let's take them out. So here are the crystals out of the package. Again, I'm going to go by technically order of importance. <laughs> so here's Ultraman Belial. Um, obviously, like what I said before, he's the other lateral half used to summon the Huami crystal along with Ultraman. And just like Jade, um, he has the lightning strikes. So it's like a, I actually like this pair, like the father and son pair, just like with them, um, seven and zero. I really appreciate that. <laughs> Obviously, he's purple. I don't know what his kanji is. Um, no, I don't know why I did the Rosso formation first. I should, yeah, here's the blue formation first. <laughs> um, then the Rosso formation. I know it doesn't matter, but this is blue's main one. His, this is mainly blues. I don't know why it calls that off. Um, and he is B058. So there you go, Belio. Um, here's Ginga Victory. And it's actually nice seeing it. I'm being represented by a color other than green. Because I, I don't, again, like... Like I've been saying, I don't understand how they choose for an Ultraman to be represented by green. I don't understand why they made Ging of Victory green. So it's nice to see it in a split pattern. Well, honest, I kind of see Ging of Victory as blue and yellow. Not red and blue, but... Oh, well. Um, Rosal Formation. Blue Formation. And all of them, and he is B042. And then our last Ultraman, Ultraman Saga. He looks pretty nice. Saga is one of my favorite, um, excuse me, um, fusion forms. Like, I just really like it. Again, he's white. So, also, blue. Oh, and he is B040. B040. Last but not least, we got our only Kaiju. Like, this set is very similar to me with the, um... I forgot what that Belial fusion is called. The one before Atrocious. Or Atrocious. Like, the... I, I just want to call it the Ultimate Zero versus Kaiser Belial set. Because that's the only name I can remember. Because that's from Orb. Um, but basically, you know, you got, like, three Kaijus... Then you got like one um, Ultraman. Now here it's like you got three Ultraman and one Kaiju. So here's Grugio King. And comparing it with Grugio Bone. Um, <laughs> I feel like the art styles have definitely changed. Because this definitely looks like concept art. And this actually looks like a CGI render of it. <laughs> Which I guess I find off putting. But oh well. Obviously Kaiju. You just flip it all up. And this one is B070. So let's get our root Jaro. So obviously we're going to start off with Belial Blue Formation. As you heard, it actually said it a phrase. I don't know what it's saying because I don't watch Roop subbed. 
But anyways, um, there's actually a second sound. And there's a sound from Belial. See, this is what I wanted out of the Orb Origin Crystal. <laughs> because I think it makes sense. Because technically, it's summoning the Kiwami Crystal. So, I think the, the Orb Ring... Or the Orb... The Orb Origin Crystal should have just said something. Anyways... It still says the same thing, it's just different lights up. See, it just freaks out. <laughs> I think I might have mistaken in the last video. Like, I think when it sees purple and red, it just freaks out because it doesn't know what to do. I think a victory. I don't know. Again, it's pretty nice hearing that again. Because Ging of Victory's um, transformation sound is pretty cool. Blue formation. Gotta wait for the star map. <laughs> oh. See, this made me realize that with my original Rube Jar review, there's like so much things I forgot to talk about. <laughs> like, just like, see, and now I'm forgetting about it. But like, one of the things is just like, I don't like, like, when like you're trying to pull it and then it doesn't actually pull. So <laughs> then that, so I'm like, you know, I don't know what I'm trying to say. Saga. And I don't even know what the camera is doing there. It's like going like, it's transitioning up and down, which looks cool, but it's not, it's not capturing it correctly because I think down below, like recording, like here, it's like one dash, like one slash 30. But then like when it gets to that, it's in like one slash 125. So I don't know if that's like how much frames it's going, but... Now it's saying 60. So, yeah. <laughs> so that's it for Saga. So obviously let's do our only Kaiju Crystal. I don't know why I didn't bother grabbing it. Gotta wait for the star map and then insert it. So that's the summoning sound for it. Obviously on that, like where worm is basically the sound when you, um, the standby for inserting in orb dark mode. And the thing I actually want to show you is that something from the show. So obviously um when um Aizen's um Rude Gyro is out of commission because um he summoned Grudia and I think because of Horboros like because of what happened with him, um he got his his um Rube Gyro got damaged. Or it's like the AZ driver. Like the Eisen Eisen driver? <laughs> the Eisen Gyro. So basically, um 
obviously in the show when he's using the um, <laughs> the Rube Jaro Saki beautification version, um, he inserts Grugio Bone. But then, Saki takes it out and switches it with Grugio King. And obviously that had an additional phrase. Well, if you actually do that here, it actually does it. So it's still the same sound. So, like the fact that you can technically chain these two together and there's another one obviously it's it makes me wonder why um you know you can't do fusions <laughs> so like right here Mebius and Hikari I can't fuse these two together because it's not programmed to do that um Korean Saga whoa we got Cosmos and Dinah and Zero, but I can't chain them together, so it's like it just makes me question why you can't do that for the Ultras, but you can do that for Grugio Bone. But again, I have to say, I have to give them props for the fact that you're able to um, chain these together, and that I was like, what did I do to the image? It's so like off. And just to prove, um, this will still do group slugger attack despite doing a special sound. Like, I know it advertises with Ginga, but Belio is the more important one. So, yeah, overall, what I think about this set is that it's it's not as playable as the first three sets. But um, I like the little touches they did with it. Obviously, um, Belial was used to summon half of the Kiwami Crystal. And Grugio King can be used... Oh, my gosh. <laughs> after... Grugio Bone to have an additional phrase, which again, I think is a really nice touch. And then, like, obviously, you get two Fusion Ultraman because, um, because of Roop. So, again, this is a really nice selection of crystals. Like, it's just pretty, it's just nice seeing a crystal that actually does something different. Um, like, it's technically still just a normal rube crystal it's just ha it just has an additional phrase which i appreciate but yeah that'll be it for this video so this is power writer and i'll leave people i just feel like i end these so abruptly <sighs>